You're watching HowToPlayAnySong.com. My name is Joe Wiles with the Rock and Roll Conservatory, and in this video, we're taking a look at Joan Jett's I Love Rock and Roll. Now, the cool thing about this song is it's a cover that Joan Jett chose to do, but she's probably the most famous person to do it. But her original recording of it featured Steve Jones and Paul Cook of the Sex Pistols. Now, that was never released, but copies of it are distributed and are actually considered prized possessions among Joan Jett fans. In this video, we're going to take a look at the intro, which is basically the chorus, as well as the verse. And let's get started. All right, the intro, which is also the chorus for I Love Rock and Roll, starts with an open E power chord, which is your open E string, second fret A, and second fret D. I use the pad on my index finger for those. You'll hit it twice. And then you'll take a little break and hit it twice again. And then you'll use your middle finger to grab the third fret of the low E string and bend it. Then you'll go to an open A power chord, which is an open A string, second fret D, second fret G, and again, just use the pad of your index finger to fret that. You'll hit it twice. Then you're gonna go to a B power chord, which is the second fret of the A, fourth fret of the D, fourth fret of the G, hit it twice, and then do that third fret bend on the low E string again. And you'll repeat that. This is what it sounds like. And on the last time, you'll hit that B power chord, and then right immediately back to the low E, uh, the open E power chord. And then you'll come up here to the seventh fret of the A string, and the ninth fret of the D, and hit it twice before you hit the riff that finishes off the introduction. The riff is on the 15th fret of the B string. You're gonna bend it up, release it back to this original position, then pull off to the 12th fret of the B, and then the 14th fret of the G, and then the 12th fret of the G. This is what that sounds like. Just like that. Now, this is the whole intro riff put together slowly. And you just repeat that. Here's the intro to beat. One, two, three, four. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Make sure you tune your browser to howtoplayanysong.com for the rest of this tutorial and to learn how to play the songs you want to learn. I'll see you there.